Hi everybody and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Today guys I'm going to be sharing another massage with you and today we're going to be concentrating on nasal labial folds and some of the mouth lines. Uh, this is a very highly requested massage all the time so I try to do them quite often to introduce different techniques to you. So all you're going to need is some clean hands, some oil if you prefer doing uh, massages with oils, cream serum. You can use it water uh, or a spray but you might have to reapply just because water evaporates very quickly and preferably a little glove or gloves um, because we might be going not might we will be going into the inside of the mouth um, you can also just have very clean hands but make sure they're very 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 clean once you go inside of your mouth so we're going to start with a little bit of a warm-up and I'm gonna use some oil for this I'm usually using my Aurelia oils uh, a night one or a day one it is daytime now so I'm gonna be using my my day one uh, I will leave the link below I also have a discount code for them I always say this um, definitely not an upsell I've been using them way 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 before they actually offered me a discount code which is always my favorite way to start working with brands so I'm gonna apply a little bit of oil onto my neck and onto my shoulders and then I'm just gonna pump a couple of times into my collarbone so inside just a couple of presses right there just warming up the lymphatic system. Let's go for a few more. And from there, let's just work around the neck. I'm gonna swing my necklace around. So what I like to do is I like to pinch my skin like this. You might want to have dry hands and then you're gonna just work your way towards your armpits. So this is very, very good to do before any massage, uh, just so the lymphatic system is working, the lymph nodes are open, and we can drain those toxins out. We're working with deeper tissue here, so don't be afraid to do this. And then we're gonna go to the opposite side, switch hands, see what feels best. Some redness is absolutely normal, it's just a blood flow, and some blood coming to the surface of your skin. And let's do a couple of drains down the neck from the ears towards the collarbones. I like to cross my hands. I find it more comfortable to use them that way. Okay, so I'm not going to use any oil on my face quite yet. We're going to start working around this area. I've got some uh, post uh, breakout spots and situations, but they are healing quite well. So I just let them be. I just let them do their thing. So let's start around the mouth. We're first going to warm up the tissue by slightly pinching in that area and working around the area of the nasal labial fold. If you feel pain or discomfort, stay in that area for a little bit longer. So ideally, let's try to stay from in an upward motion. And then the other side, so also the marionette lines, we're working on those as well. So all the folds are a lot of the times created because of the hollows. So sometimes if you pull your skin like this, you will see that it becomes hollow in a space. So we need to fill that space. We need to promote the collagen production. Just little pinches, making tiny little folds of the skin. And then we're gonna go with a couple of pinches like this. Just warming up this area. Like I say, a little bit of no redness is completely normal. So don't be put off by that. Unless you have very sensitive skin or rosacea, um, then I would maybe stay away from so much manipulation on the face. Uh, but the buccal massage, you know, intraoral massage, you can still do. Pinch, 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 and let's release. And then we're gonna work with the connective tissue from the nostrils that connects uh, to the rest of the tissues right here. So I want you to try and almost like pinch it in here and just rub it, rub those tissues together. Funny faces, I know, but gotta do what you gotta do. So if you, especially here, if you're feeling quite a lot of discomfort, 
Just try to be gentle, but just massage that area for a little bit longer. A lot of people tend to feel a little bit of sensitivity in that area. So as you can see, I'm going around the nostrils and the folds. Okay, let's go inside of the mouth. So let's put the glove on if you're using a glove and then we will go inside of the mouth to iron out the folds from the inside. So my thumb is going to go in and my first finger is going to support from the outside. I have a whole video on intraoral massage. If you just want to do buccal massage, then check that video. I will leave it in the description box below. It is very, very effective for things like this. So circular motion from inside and outside. Buccal massage, not more than maybe once, maximum two times a week. And we can do the same down here if you tend to get smoker's lines and marionette lines. So go under the lip and then massage over. Well done everybody. You can also work a little bit into the jaws uh, while we're here, but the nasal labial fold area will benefit from it as well. So we're gonna go on the lower jaw, thumbs go in, and then we are scooping, we're scooping up the tissue. And again, there is still a circular motion happening inside. And then you can go along the whole jawline and work into the chewing muscle Release some tension there. And let's take it onto the opposite side. So we're gonna go with the thumb in and go circular. So I like to make an O shape with my mouth just so I stretch the skin. And let's go lower. And into the smoker's lines. So as you can see, I'm trying to push my thumb out so I'm not creating folds while I'm massaging. So look, I keep pushing my thumb out. And release. Let's take the glove off and we will do a little bit more of the massage. You can apply a little bit of oil here if you like. So I'm just gonna press a little bit into the area and then I'm gonna place the back of my thumbs in and flick them out. So a little bit of vibration. So I'm turning them out and then I'm flicking them out. You can go lower into the marionette lines as well. 
I've been so sleep deprived you guys I can definitely see it uh, on my eyes so I think I'm gonna film an eye massage next um, because I definitely need it myself so might as well share it with you and a little bit of this kind of motion uh, I don't even know what you call it but I'm using the pads of my fingers and then I'm going towards the ears or in a direction of your ears rather again moving up and down so we involve those lines right here as well and let's just sweep and all the way down sweep and down just so we can drain everything out towards the collarbones and that my friends is it i hope you enjoyed this massage let me know if you have any questions or any requests for future videos leave them in the comment section below i always try to keep an eye on what you guys need and i hope you're all having a wonderful day don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that yet and i will see you guys very very soon in my next video bye